What's up everybody, welcome back. In this video, we gotta take each of these four polynomial expressions and simplify them. So basically what we have to do is collect like terms and then simplify the like terms. Starting off with number one, we got 3x plus 6y minus 7z minus, in brackets, 3x minus 2y minus 4z. So first thing we have to do here is we have to distribute this negative one that's in front inside the bracket. So we would rewrite this here, so it'd be 3x plus 6y minus 7z. Distribute the negative, so negative 1 times 3x is negative 3x. And then uh, negative 1 times negative 2y is positive 2y. And then negative 1 times negative 4z is positive 4z. And now that the brackets are all gone, you can just collect like terms. So notice that the 3x minus the 3x, those are like terms. Those will just cancel out. Then we got 6y plus 2y. That gives us 8y. And then uh, negative 7z plus 4z. That gives us uh, negative 3z. So that there is your final answer for number one. So 8y minus... 3z is the simplified polynomial expression for number one. So moving on to number two, same thing, this negative one here, we would distribute inside the bracket. So we would rewrite all of this. So we'd have 3x squared minus 5xy minus 6y squared and then um, distributing that negative one inside the bracket. Basically, everything stays the same, but the signs change. So it would be plus 4x squared minus xy. And then from here, you simply have to collect the like terms. So 3x squared, 4x squared, those are like terms. That would give us 7x squared. Then we got minus 5xy minus 1xy. There's like a 1 in front there. That would give us minus 6xy. And then this is minus 6y squared. All right, so that is the answer over here. So 7x squared minus 6xy minus 6y squared. All right, so moving on to number three. We got 4xy minus 5xz plus yz minus 4xz plus 10yz minus, in brackets, 5xy plus 7xz. So whenever you see a number in front of a bracket, you're going to have to distribute it inside the bracket. Over here, there's like a one in front, so basically everything stays the same so we could pretty much just get rid of this bracket here over here there are no brackets and then this bracket we're going to have to distribute the negative one so let's rewrite everything we'll have 4xy minus 5xz plus yz minus 4xz uh, I'm going to use two lines here, plus 10yz. And then distributing the negative one inside the bracket, we'd have minus 5xy minus 7xz. So what are all the like terms here? So we got 4xy and negative 5xy. So 4xy minus 5xy gives us negative xy. And then we got minus 5 xz minus 4xz and then there's another xz over here so minus 5 minus 4 is negative 9 minus 7 gives us negative 16 xz and then we're left with 1yz plus 10yz which gives us 11yz so that there is your final answer for number three and then finally number four we got 2 over 3x minus 4 over 5y minus in brackets 3 over 4x plus 1 over 3y. So here we're dealing with fractions, but nevertheless it's the same thing. You treat these fractions like you would any number in front. 
So we would rewrite 2 over 3x minus 4 over 5y, and then distribute the negative inside, so you'd have negative 3 over 4x minus 1 over 3y. So now you just collect like terms. So you got 2 over 3x minus 3 over 4x. So you're dealing with fractions. So you could even do the fractions on the side here. So 2 over 3 minus 3 over 4 would be what? That would be common denominator 12. So it'd be like 8 over 12 minus 9 over 12. Right, so I multiplied this by 4, so I multiply the top by 4, multiply this by 3, multiply the top by 3 to get 9. So this is negative 1 over 12. So we would end up with negative 1 over 12x. And then the rest, we got negative 4 over 5y minus 1 over 3y, so negative 4 over 5 minus 1 over 3 equals negative 12 over 15 minus 5 over 15, which gives us negative 17 over 15. So this would be minus 7 over 15. Why? So that there is your final answer for number 4. So basically all you're doing is you're taking all the brackets, expanding them, getting rid of the brackets, and then just simplifying all of the like terms to get a simplified expression.